I just start us off. Right, right, you right. want to just start us off with uh, just, just being out here, man. It feels like the off season was just a blur. You guys are right back out here, back to work for spring ball, and just the first day out there. Um, what's the feeling and the vibe feeling like for you guys? Uh, it felt great being back out there on the field. Uh, you know, as you know, it's been a long time since uh, December in the bowl game. So for us to get back out the field for the first time, you know, it was a lot of excitement. Of course, we got day one energy. Uh, our mindset is keep the day one energy every day. A lot of guys out there making plays. A lot of new faces out there. Um, old old guys out there still, you know, leading. So we out there having a good time, teaching the young guys how we how we do things and keeping them ahead of the game. What's the motivation? Number seven. Um, two plus five. Two plus five. Uh, did you see your completion? Number seven. Um, you know, it was just a, a number I wore back when I was a kid, and my coach told me to get the number, and it was actually my one of my best years playing football. I wore it again in high school at quarterback, and so I said, man, I got, I got, I need a rebirth. I need, I need, I need something. I need something. So I said, you know. Back to where I used to wear two plus five, so you know, seven. You know, I've been here. It's be my fifth year at NC State. I feel like this is the year that it's all gonna come together. Aside from the number, what type of growth are you looking to have going into the season for yourself? I'm just looking at growing, putting a little bit more body weight on. Um, football IQ is the biggest thing I want to focus on. <coughs> understanding <coughs> down and distance, um, <coughs> understanding game situations, uh, my press coverage, um, understanding field zones and a lot of football IQ stuff, so a lot of film on. This offseason, you were active in a lot of other things outside of football, too. I mean, what types of things did you work on this offseason off the field uh, in terms of NIL, things like that? Um, so I, 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 um, I have a clothing line called Battle Island. Um, that's what I've been working on since my freshman year of college. I recently received an equity deal with Obsess, um, and that, that was something that took a spark in my brand and something that I've been taking a lot, putting a lot of time into on the outside of football and school, something that I just do when I have free time. But um, it's something that's helping me grow my brand. And um, I've worked with different companies that they've put me in connections with to help me grow and network. And I'm excited for what, we, what we're working on. And I also have um, a, a camp that I have back in my hometown that I did for the first time last year in July. Um, <coughs> I call it the Attitude 52 Camp Showdown. Just something to get the community together, get guys out on the platform that can get looked at, have fun, and compete, network. Um, it's something that I enjoy doing. Um, it's just me giving back to my community. The community loves it, the city loves it, and the city provides all the services for me. So, something I want to continue to do.